Gamers. Gamers. Gamers! We're gaming. All right, let's go to the beach and get slutty. Only you, Cloud. No, welcome to the stream. It's not a stream, it's a video. It's, well, it's a pre-record. And I'll be playing some uh, stuff. I don't know 100% what I want to do here today. Um... Abdumbral Throng. That's what I want to do. I want to do the Abdumbral Throng. We're going to do that. Just some stuff. Um, I might do the cards now. I don't know if this is going to be part of another video or if it's just going to be its own thing. But I was in the mood to play. The robed figures are shambling towards some unknown destination. Find out exactly what it is. If you wish to give the group a nudge, you can push them from behind with L2. I'm just trailing them. You are chatting. That's the plan. At least till they get to wherever they're going. <laughs> Getting sleepy, are we? With how slow they walk, who wouldn't? We can run on ahead and play scout. But stay where we can see you. <sighs> oh boy. Since we left the veil. Never should have dropped the intellectual shtick. He admits it. But yeah, this is how about how about this? Um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep pushing them. Go. Faster. What is this side quest? Well, it's an action-packed video. Can these guys do anything? Right. I have to see what weapon skills I have to level up. Materia. There's no way we can save him from everything. We'll do what we can. Hey, so what kind of stuff do you think they're thinking about? The black robes? I don't know. Yes. A relic, maybe? I doubt they're lucid enough to even know what they're doing. Be better that way. Sad, but true. Yes. I bet they've seen some things. Reduced to their instincts, like animals. Man, screw Shinra. Damn right. Bears be straight up jorking these black cloaks. I, I I don't know what's wrong with me. I I man man, I'm just I'm just happy to be gaming. And that this is the best possible gaming. Let me let me tell you. Tifa needs to do something. Gorm. The, the, the Gorm bangle. Well, hope everyone out there is doing okay. If the beginning of this video didn't deter you, then... Perhaps this will. And they found that there were none. Or so the official statement claimed. Oh, no need to worry then. If I may put your minds at ease, both Nibelheim's water tower and pipe 
network utilized filtration devices that were state-of-the-art for the time. Furthermore, there was no evidence that water quality was impacted by the reactor. The filters likely mitigated any deleterious effects. Well, I grew up drinking that water. That certainly explains a lot. Sure those filters worked? You tell me. I believe Shinra. Yeesh. What a mess. Shinra has done nothing but tell truth and modify cocks so that they could be big. Using granny tears, they have made everyone have big Mako cocks. And this is why Square doesn't want to work with me. Well, that and I don't thank them enough. You're dead. Don't overdo it. It's weird. Square works with me in limited capacities. Sometimes I hear from them. They send me a thing. Sometimes I don't. Come on. It, it is what it is. They send me, you know, if they send me stuff, I'm, I'm always happy. And if I don't, I'm, you know, if the game is good and not Chocobo Racing, I'm usually pretty happy to uh, just buy it myself. I don't, I don't mind. But you know, always, always nice to be in the rarefied category of Square invites me to an event or sends me a game. is a proto relic anyway. Chadley, can't you just use the phone? Little wonder I was unable to locate it. I suspect other creatures are in possession of the remainder. So what now? Oh. Your hooded friends may well lead us to other fragments. That actor had to have said the word cloud more than any other human. More than some other human. I mean, I guess we're I guess we're doing this. You know, obviously the card stuff is is um, on the table as well. for this particular vid video. Could be. There's, um... There's some side quests here. I've done no side quests in Gungog. 
think we got fans. They're after the proto relic too. Ignore them. Gongog. That's where we're gonna go. Actually, I don't know if I want to go there. There were people saying, Vinny, do the Tifa quests. But I'm not 100% sure that's gonna happen yet. Chocobo Sage's Manor. Oh, what happened? Billy? Did you see that broom? What are you doing out here? Um, I haven't had much luck at the racetrack lately. Not the good kind, that's for sure. So I came here to train. Train? Here? You don't know where you are? This is the home of THE Chocobo Sage, a living legend. Surely you've heard of the man. <laughs> oh my god. Did someone say living legend? <coughs> this guy wasn't the original. He was like purple and weird and not even human, maybe. You okay, sir? <sighs> I am now. Thought I was a goner. Huh? Mind telling me who you are? I don't get many visitors out here in the boonies. Uh, this is Cloud. He's a jockey for Gramps' ranch. Oh, he is, huh? Perfect. Billy here needs some help. You can pick up the poor boy's slack. There's this big race at the saucer, the Gold Cup, and it's coming up soon. We gotta get in on that, so I came here to bone up. I'm learning all sorts of stuff. See? Hey, tell me you're not buying this choco dung. Picking garbage out of a pool isn't training, it's manual labor. You see it too, right? Not the sage. Well, Doi, he's not a sage. This guy's like the king of the crazy old coots. The other guy was purple. I don't know about coot, but Gramps did say he was already old when he was young. If you can flap your gums, you can move your gams. Now get on back to your training. Sorry. As for you, I know just the thing. One of my chocobos ran off when we put her out to pasture. Need you to find her. Bring her back. You're asking me? Her name you look is like Selena. one. Ain't your normal chocobo neither. Loves the ocean more than home. The way she makes rolling waves look like solid ground. No wonder she thinks she's the bee's knees. Please, Cloud, would you mind? Just think of it as a favor for me. You've got a gift for wrangling the wild ones. I really don't want to do chocobo wrangling. I already found him. There you are, Selena. Oh. Well, I underestimated you. Takes real skill to tame this. Well, that was easy. Skills like those of. Hold on. I know this. I do. Why can't I remember? God oh, damn it! This is gonna bother me all day. Oh. Aha! There we go. It was Sam and Will. What? They were far and away my best disciples. As I was saying, you, Cloud, you may well become as talented a trainer as them one day. <laughs> Did I hear you right? Sam, you gotta tell me everything you know about him. You're gonna give me whiplash, son. <sighs> the Sam guy you taught. You mean Chocobo Sam out of Midgar? I do, but... Why do you want to know? I fucking hate him. Because me and him, we got history. You see, I'm Will's son. Well, don't that beat all. Choco drama. I'll never forget those two. They had such a powerful passion and an eagerness to learn, too. Everything they did was for the birds. That's not the Sam I know. For the birds is not usually a good thing, right? He led my parents to an early grave. Got them hooked on gambling, pushed uh. him to rack up tons of debt, and then... Eh, that don't sound like him to me. You sure you ain't got your Sams mixed up? It's a common name, you know. 
Only one Sam in this business. I swore that I'd humiliate him by winning the gold cup. Destroy his reputation. Then I'd at least have some kind of revenge for what that bastard did to my parents. Hmm. Now that that's out of your system, back to it. Excuse me? You heard me. Thought you came out here to learn about chocobos, not to get revenge. Uh... Cloud, for your next task, I'll need you to take Selena and gather choco grass, which so happens to grow above bodies of water. You kidding me? This fossil's trying to get us to do his dirty work again? God. <gasps> Okay. Choco grass is a genuine panacea. I kid you not. It'll cure whatever ails you, and then some. Then once I am cured, maybe I'll be inclined to share more stories about the good old days. Wow, I don't want to hear them. <sighs> He's obviously full of it. If not for him, then please do it for me. I need to know what happened to my dad. <sighs> Okay. Listen, kid, I feel bad. When I said it grows above water. I meant above. It's called the floating flower, because it grows in the air. But with an ocean chocobo, you can harvest the stuff with ease. Do I not have Very this shit? Ought to do. I'm pretty sure I have a Best bunch of this shit. It, Cloud. You don't want my death on your hands. Want do your you? death on my hands. <laughs> oh, you get your hands I on did all of this grass? already. <laughs> This all you uh, got? Never mind. Ain't nowhere near enough. Why is Chadley here? I see you've secured yourself a rather intriguing vessel. I hope to create a ship of my own one day. Perhaps even an airship. You'll have to join me on its maiden voyage. Not even moving his lips. Chudlock Combat Simulator. I heard Yuffie was good for this fight. I'm gonna try it again real quick. You know, you know, you don't, you don't miss every shot you don't take. Wayne Gretzkum. You know. I got you, Odin. I got your number. Use the thing, use the thing. Where's the focused move?
Yuffie, you need to heal. Yuffie does not have heal! I may have this, maybe. Maybe? Maybe not? Oh god. Get out of there, Cloud. Shit, wrong move. I meant to do like a dive kick or something. I got this. Cloud, bad. Ooh. We have got to heal. Get his ass, Yuffie. Hang back. Oops, did the thing by accident again. Like that. We gotta switch it out. My turn. Well, Tifa dead. Oh god, I don't think I have a raise ability right now. Oh man, what have I done? Get cut up. Please don't do that. Please. That was a lot closer. Why why was I told to use Yuffie? I'm just not sure. Perhaps you're having an off day. I Chadley's very passive aggressive. Yeah, I'm not sure what you, Yuffie's bringing to the table here. Let me try Barrett, maybe? looking for it 
revival material. Kate Sith has one. Because Barrett also has good range and he's got focused shots too. Oh, loud. Have you come to brush up on your bird handling? As soon as I heard the uh, legendary yes. chocobo say, I was surprised even hermits enjoy a dip in the pool. That's really insightful, Chadley. I got you, Chadley. I understand. You just want to dip in the pool with the old men. It's fine. I got this shit now. And I have to use haste on Cloud. I forgot to do that previously. But I still have the knowledge from last time. Job. Look at that stagger. Fill right up. That is the good shit. Got to keep using abilities, I guess. No, no. Summon Alexander, fuck it. Do your thing. Come on. Do something. Limit break.
There we go. He healed. Shit, Tifa's stuck a stone now. Well, I was just about to use a summon uh, ability, but this is fine. this oh yeah mistake could have spelled certain doom but your persistence paid off in the I end. leveled a little since With I last played and I, I also this remembered the blade will certainly help you cut a path to victory needless I, to say, I remembered many hazards await you on the road so take care so there you go Odin defeated in a pre-record Can increase the level of the summoning material to a maximum of four through crystal analysis. I don't know what that means. Crystal analysis. This material cannot gain levels. Oh. Some of them are just kind of stuck that way, huh? Alright, well that felt pretty good. So... Yeah, Odin defeated. I definitely leveled a little bit since I last attempted Odin, there's no doubt about it, but I also, like I said, I just had time, I know I've said this like three times, but I had time to process the, um, oops, I had a little bit of time to process, like, how this fight is supposed to go down. Are you here to learn from the sage as well? I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it, okay? It'll all pay off in the end. I promise. I kind of want to do this just because I'm so close to finishing it. Hey, since you seem to be in the know, give me the kiss. Who's the sand guy? Big shot in Walmart. Uh huh. He must be pretty scummy. I don't know. Scummy. The nail business aside. You didn't strike me as a total asshole. Interesting. Or maybe your powers of perception weren't long enough to see through his facade. 
That's gotta be it. Oh, I love that. That was a great line from Cloud. That's gotta be it. Cloud just embodies the 90s. Don't worry, Cloud. I'm not gonna leave the 90s. I'm stuck in them. I've embraced my, you know, 90s. But I've also embraced a lot of newer stuff, too. But Cloud's whole, like, attitude of, like, get help. That's gotta be it. And many, many, many other examples just endears me to him. So much. He's a miserable bastard, and I love it. Oh! You get your hands on that choco grass! Well, well, if it ain't my beloved choco grass. This stuff can be one hell of a hassle to gather. Thank goodness I had you to get it for me. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? <laughs> I'm gonna stick it up my bum! I you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff, mix it with some chocobo feathers, and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Then I squeeze it all out and voila! My patented choco tincture. That's some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. This wrinkly, cheeky old... Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts... You should touch it! Would you mind sharing them with my assistant at the shop? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Please, tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's still one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise. This geezer isn't gonna tell you Jack. Face it, kid. You got a lot of nerve. Casting aspersions. After all the wisdom I've shared. All the what now? So you haven't realized you've been training this whole time? Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's feelings. And all that running across the water you did helped hone your sense of balance and your bird handling. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. I'm a, I'm, Can't yeah, say I do. choco pro. That's Sounds me. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Aw, uh, dude. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got no. a deal. But know that I won't be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. I'm here to give you a holler, but you're moving very, very slow. Are you sure you're not one of those those robed people? You prepared to undertake the final trial? They're here specifically for the Chocobo Sage. Like, they weren't even here for Sephiroth. Sometimes when I have a particularly messy poop, I look in the toilet, I'm like, did Sephiroth do this? You could just cut that, Johnny. I'm going to bet you $1,000 Johnny does not cut that because he didn't watch it. Guaranteed. And that's okay. I said it knowing full well the consequences. Remember how to race real quick.
Where did the Chocobo Sage, like, just create a level? Like, a, a racetrack from... I had forgot, literally forgot what buttons to press. It says most of them. It says all of them on the screen, but I, I didn't want to look away. Losing to you, Chocobo Sage. Not even real Chocobo Sage. was one hell of a performance. If I didn't know better, I'd say this wasn't your first rodeo. Surprise. <laughs> well, shoot. You got me good. And once you start tearing up the track out there, the racing world will blame me for letting you loose. A promise is a promise, sir. Please tell me more about my dad and Uncle Sam. Hmm. All right, then. What do you want to know? Wasn't nothing out of the ordinary, I'd say. Ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, your standard training regimen. And in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library, learning about chocobos and how to handle them. Came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos, and it drove them to fight, with their words and with their fists. That said, the only reason those two fought as hard as they did is because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion is concerned, the two of them were birds of a feather. How you feel now? Managed to sort out the mess inside? Uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. Time to look deep inside yourself and clear out all the wickedness and spite that have been haunting your heart. Which is why you had him clean out the pool? Exactly. I don't know what happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why you'd want to beat old Sam in a race. Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, 
You should never use your birds as tools for revenge. Ask yourself, why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess... I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun, and brought us together as a family. I guess that's why. Good enough. The why is important, so don't forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred, and you'll do fine. Unclouded. Thank you, sir. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. Uh oh, that's a Yuffie thing? Oh, no, 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 no. We have to do more Tifa quests then. Well, I know where some of them are, and then there's like the muscle quests. Oh my god, everyone's just spawned all together there. Yeah, we're doing this again. Where do you think these ones are off to? I guess the proto relic. We are having so much fun here today, looking to find the Proto Relic. What is? These black robes. They all smell the same, more or less. Is it the Mako, you think? Could be, but I doubt it. They're sent. They're just Yu-Gi-Oh players. Heavier? To me, a person's scent is one of their most defining features. But all these guys smell almost identical. Definitely Yu-Gi-Oh. What do I smell like? You smell like you. Simple as that. And me? What? What? Do I smell like rotten eggs or something? Yes. The fuck is this game mechanic? Like, what is this? Cooking all right. Yeah. All that black's gotta be stifling. Oh, it is. Trust and believe. Hotter than a friggin' oven. I still can't believe they managed to cross the desert in those getups. Pretty crazy. Some did. Not all. We ran into a bunch before you joined, Yuffie. And Midgar? I saw my fair share when I was there, too. Never came across them before that, though. Now that I think about it. Live next to him for a bit. Shame you can't just like tackle them like Dragon's Dogma too. Wonder if you just push one rope guy, if that's like enough. Huh? What do you think they're pointing at? There's a submarine dock beneath the harbor. Maybe that. I bet you that's where we'll find the proto relic. Oh, I see. Maybe us go and fish it out. The simplest way inside would be by sea. And Selena's got us covered.
Oh, that's where this is? Man, I wish the whole map was just this exploration. With with this exact chocobo. I wish I wish this was just like What is going on here? Um Yeah, it's just the most fun. I've said it before, but it's it's true. Easy. Potion, a regular potion. Nice limit break, Cloud. Well done. It's weird how this game gets chocobos really right, in my opinion, but Moogle's really wrong. Whereas Final Fantasy 16 got chocobos pretty wrong. And I don't remember if they were Moogles. Oh, the Moogle was pretty good. Climb over your friends. Yeah. Let me 
Yeah, there are things I learned about this combat system, like 50 hours in, like focused strikes. Increased stagger. Like, stuff like that, I just didn't... Like, I didn't know. I probably learned it and then didn't pay attention. That's very possible. But it has improved the experience and made the game a little bit easier. I have the magnify materia. I don't think they were close enough. Definitely gonna summon Odin for this fight. Finish it. Let me teach him a lesson. You ready? Now's our chance. Uh, now's our chance. Time to end this. You dare summon me, Odin? I need you to kill a couple cave yeah. trolls. Cave trolls, can you do that? It would be so beautiful. It's on you. Can you take over for me? Get their ass. Unbelievable. You're done. Take him down. You're out of luck. This one's for you. That's it. Tagging out. All set. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Hey, Cloud? Yeah? These guys and Sephiroth are related somehow. Like, connected on some really weird, deep level. Right? Seems so. Seems so? I don't have proof, just a hunch. But the more I see, the more I know I'm right. Just one more reason why we gotta put a stop to that crazy bastard. He is a crazy bastard, I agree. <laughs> uh, Chadley is a crazy oh, bastard. Uh, I didn't mean to startle you. I simply wanted to inform you that I've located more rogue individuals. Copy. Send us the coordinates. Of course. Right away. We're almost done with the entire region. I, I enjoyed this region. So it was it was worth finishing up. I think I'm gonna save cards for live because people like to bet. Also, I wanted to get the Barith combo.
you know, Barrett. Uh, I'm going to check it out real quick. Let's see. So we have Aerith, Barrett, Cloud. I need to buy some Chocobo uh, cushions. I don't even know where you buy these fucking things. I don't remember. Baby Chocopo, where are you? I also really, um... Ah, uh, fuck, I forgot what I was gonna say. Doesn't matter. Something's not right. Oh boy, here we go again. Powerful offensive abilities while they're casting a spell. Fucking good. Damn. It's the sunglasses that make all the difference. Chadley should wear sunglasses. He'd be a lot cooler. Doing in a place like this? Unless... No. Well, now. This I did not expect. My precious specimens. And you. Chadley. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. CDA 6, was it? Or 7, perhaps? Oh shit. Previous dead One, Chudlot. Two, three, four, five, Maybe. Six. Aha. Yes. Lucky number 7. 
You and your brothers are just full of surprises, aren't you? <laughs> Don't be shy now. Open up and let me see what makes you tick. There's a good boy. That's so weird, dude. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, dig into his brain. Good job, Hojo. I'm fine. How many fucking Chadleys are there, though? It seems our roped friends are on the move again. You'd best follow closely behind. I would hate for any of them to run afoul of one of Hojo's experiments. Please, keep them from harm. Cloud, have you met my brother? Dadly. Sorry, that's my father. It's Chadley, Scradley, Bradley, Dadley, Ladley. He's English. Old lighthouse, among other things. Never checked it out myself, though. I wonder if there's a tea room. A what? A tea room. In Wutai, you can't throw a ninja star without hitting at least a couple, you know? Tea's always free. The food, on the other hand, that's how they get you. That's so. Well, I don't think we're gonna find one here. Or anywhere else nearby. Ooh. let the roped individuals through. <laughs> My favorite gameplay mechanics are the ones that just could be done in a cutscene. <laughs> Gotta use that haptic feedback on the LNR. Wow, Aerith. Just zooming all over the place. Wow. Wow. Maximum Chadley.
Pay attention to the valves and align the arrows. <laughs> Most fun game mechanic. No, I I was looking at my phone while doing this, and I wasn't even paying attention. That this other stuff was happening like this. Wow. Yuffie's like, can, can you hurry up, please? <laughs> she's growing on me a little bit here and there, but she's still got her Yuffie-isms. I don't know. Our personalities just don't mesh. But, I mean, I don't, I don't hate her or anything. She's fine. And there's growth, there's character growth. Lightning. Hitting it, its eye with physical attacks will deal a large amount of damage. I still use, like, only two wards, and I, I probably should use more than that. again. I want to watch it in full. Awesome. Did 
They multiply? <sighs> Broden? Broden! Hey! Snap out of it! Wait! The guy from Calm? Oh no shit! Is he Mako poisoned? No. He's a former soldier. It calls to me. I must answer. Well, that's a callback I didn't expect. treatment in Nibelheim too? You good? Come. I found another gathering of these individuals. The largest yet. It would appear that they're headed for the coastline. Do you think you could investigate for me? We'll do. This is still wow, this is a long quest. It's time. Time we checked it out. I don't know what all this proto relic stuff is leading up to. Like, is it is it worth doing some and not the others? And I might have actually even gotten the answer to that. Light Genova tinkling. Not like that. The music. Hello, Cloud. Do you know what that purring means? It, she's happy. Thank you for the pets. Welcome. Would you like a room? Welcome. Safe travels. The anxious heart. Uh, version uh, in this game is is phenomenal. It's a hard team to not want to use. If Vincent and Sid were in the game, I'd I would check them out a little bit. But Tifa, Barrett, and Cloud, what a team! Aerith I've been using quite a bit. Yuffie once in a while. Kate Sith is kind of a wild card. Red 13 I don't really love playing as. I haven't figured it out. <laughs> Red 13. Like a little bit, sure, but... I don't know. Another six months and I'm out of here. Level 3 limit break. Oh, man. SP20, SP20, SP... Hmm. 
ability wildfire. Yeah, that stuff increases your damage with other crap. I would love to get that limit break, but it's, it's going to probably take a while. Damage dealt by basic attacks by 3%. I mean, that's, that's pretty good. Moogle Dunk Shot. I don't know if there's a Tifa limit break. Yeah, it's right there. It's gonna take a while, but we're we're working on it. I mean it's almost Consume all ATB charges and half your HP to fire a high-powered shot. Kitty Cannonade. What the fuck is this game? Fills the other team members' limit break gauges. That's interesting. to buy something. I actually forgot you could just buy cushions at whatever store. And yes, I still think it's hilarious. This isn't your... This isn't your home anymore. Oh yeah, rub it in. Yeah! As if Cloud hasn't already, and Tifa haven't been mind-fucked. Massively. <laughs> Just rub it in. Craftsmanship 13 is required for some of this stuff. I guess we got it. Yggdrasil. Yggdras Elba. Enhanced Id Idris Elba. Better 
stuff here. Yeah, there's so many like things to consider for your equipment, which is good. I mean, this is what I want. I just don't do it too often. This is where it, it you know feels more like an RPG than just equip two things and then you're done immediately and exploration doesn't feel as meaningful. Some of these seem good, but that seems good for Cloud. You know, I'm just going to leave it for now. Home anymore. Remember that. just feels mean-spirited. What in the... What are they doing? Trying to cross the water. No, they're, they're going for a swim. Of course, it's a suspiciously shaped um, island in the form of an arena. As usual. I wonder if that Final Fantasy IX remake is actually going to happen. It would never get a, a budget for, a, you know, something like this. It didn't sell well enough. I mean, 8 is more likely to get a bigger remake than 9, but I think 9 is more... Whoa. 9 is more beloved, and I feel like that would be a really smart remake, but they'd have to figure out how to, like, do a little bit, uh, less insane. Like, maybe, like, a mid-budget. What are they? <gasps> I just want to explore Alexandria. Like, on foot. Um, in first person or, or third person, you know? That I would really love. And Lindblom, in particular. I love Lindblom. That's my favorite Final Fantasy, uh, town. Maybe of all time. Oh shit, plot ghosts. Zephy! Hey. 
What the fuck? You? I don't know what's happening. I don't. Whatever. Summoned by Charles. How dare you? Oh, I did this out of order. That's why. Get ready. Well, let's be smart. I got you now. It's a lot of weaknesses. Perfectly blocking will cause him to stumble. Oh, okay. Are you kidding me? I think after the Odin fight, I'm good. Like, I'm, you know what I mean? Like, that fight was such a nightmare for me that this doesn't even seem that bad. Speaking of. Duty calls. I think we're gonna do a doubler. It's on you. Need my help, do you? Give him hell. Hang back. Don't overdo it. I'll, I'll get you. Rousing, inspiring, even. I must fight in earnest. No. No, I don't think I will. Good job, Claude. You get the Proto Relic. What does it do? I don't know. That is the most Monster Hunter ass music I've heard in this game.
Okay. Well done. Thanks to your efforts, I've been able to develop a clearer picture of things. It seems that the garden you saw moments ago exists in a separate dimension. Nothing's ever simple. <laughs> I sense exasperation. I, however, am emboldened to solve this mystery. I only hope that you will assist me in my quest for answers. Well, Chadlington, you must understand. No. My dearest Chadley, please, no. Alright, I have a list of some Tifa quests here. Dreaming of Blue Skies. Which one is that? Did I do that quest? Complete. Okay. So now there's there's some stuff in the Corel region. M Mr. Birdie's buddy's request. No, that's not it. It's um. Hmm. Sand and circuses and gold cup or bust. I wonder if it's on the bounty board. The boot booty board. Could be on the booty board. Bodybuilders, gold cup or bust. Speak with Billy to hear the details. All right. Do they just always have a dance party right in the lobby of the Gold Saucer? I think they do. We've arrived at your destination. Attention, Chocobo Race fan. Oh, hey, Cloud. Got some news. Apparently, the powers that be like what we have to offer. Gave us permission to race in the Gold Cup. So I went and signed you up as soon as I could. After all, you're the best jockey I know. The cup is three races, and you get points based on where you place in each. Bird with the most at the end wins. But the races are nothing like you've ever seen before. Gotta be on the ball if you want to take the top spot. Anyway, when you're ready to face off against the finest riders this side of the continent, head on over to registration. So what are the odds that Sam and his bird Oh, hello, Mr. Strife. We're all looking for Mr. Strife, thank you. Gold Cup is now available. Seeing you in action again.
You cannot compete in this race yet. Oh boy. A different chocobo. Just for fun. But yeah, apparently you have to complete a couple races to get access to this one. underwater segment. I always thought the Chocobo races were so cool. Because the whole game was like pre-rendered. Uh, the original. And then you do Chocobo races. And, um, you get some nice 3D environment. their fun environment as well. Three green shells. But yeah, apparently this counts as a Tifa quest, so why not? And again, the gameplay here is really good. I actually like this racing. Like, it feels like a real racing game. Nice. I think we got this. Cloud is a top racist. Zero of three first time bronze race wins. Oh, we were doing not even real races. Oh man, I gotta do three of these? My honestly, I might end up getting like bored doing three and then another thing and then another thing. It's 
zero of ten. Oh, all right. I don't think I have the patience. Please remember that you are always welcome here. I I really don't think I have the patience for that. Um. Well. Well. There's also sand and circuses. East Battleground. Uh, I don't know where that is. All this to avoid the muscle head thing. Somewhere more quiet. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't bite. <laughs> what? Got a problem? Oh, am I holding you up? Hmm? I kind of want to look this up. Sand and Circus's side quest. You have to win five bouts at the Beast Battleground. You have to complete Trouble in Paradise side quest. Thought we... Did we not do that? Hmm. Right. Tons of Gungaga. Trouble in Paradise. It's not. Oh man, so. Oh, jeez. So that means if I want to do more Tifa stuff, I have to do all the Chocobo shit. Or. Muscle. Muscle workout mini games. I've just been trying to, I've been trying to avoid more, like, annoying mini-games that I don't want to do. I don't remember enjoying the working out mini-games. Training course. Yeah, I mean, I do love the game. It can be a little overwhelming at times. And I want to see more of the character interactions, so it sucks that some of it's locked behind, so like so many different things but that's just a uh, personal pet peeve it's it's not um i wouldn't even say it's a problem i think that it's nice that this game has as much as it does and generally the side quests have been like way better than i expected
Trouble in paradise, you say? No idea. I wonder if you can see your your level of affinity. Yeah, I guess um, I guess I am trying to get the Tifa date for whatever reason. I don't I don't really even know why. Like I care, but not that much. It's I don't know. It's weird. I can see you post captas, and there's not even a live chat. Gengaga. Don't forget to try some of it. It's break time, boys. I just, for some reason, have no interest in doing any Gaga stuff. <laughs> it's actually kind of insane. Well. That kind of leaves us with one choice just to get like one extra quest and that's um that's the muscle. It's it's time for muscles, I think. That said, I also have to make dinner and it's been an hour 50. So I'll, I'll just accept the quest. I'll get started and then probably live on stream. Yeah, live on stream sometime in the next week. I will complete the card side quest and I will do the muscle stuff. God damn it. I know where the damn gym is. I'll just save here. <laughs> Start of stream will be me just trying to finish this this quest. Yeah. Well, thank you for watching this pre-record of Final Fantasy. Sorry there were no cards. Um, you know, if this was a pre... If this was a... What is it? Premiere? I don't know how exciting this was, but... You know, if it's something that you like doing and chatting with your, your fellow chat members, that's fine. But, um, yeah, good, good times. Really enjoyed some of this. <laughs> and expect more soon. So, goodbye for now, everybody. And we will see the way Cloud thrusts and trusts in the future. And no one is shitting crazily and, and Sephiroth did it. No one.